We are now one month away from the March primary, and tonight was a big night for a man who wants to take away Jackie Lacey's job as L.A. District Attorney. Yeah, George Gascon got a big endorsement in a race dominated by talk of crime and punishment, race, and police shootings. Tonight, Kate Cowan's Chris Holmstrom live in Hollywood with our story. Chris? Yeah, this could be one of the most expensive races for the DA's office in U.S. history. And tonight, out here in Hollywood, one of those candidates is getting a powerful celebrity endorsement. How many times do I have to tell you? Do you An intimate show with John Legend, musician turned civil rights advocate. There's so much be better work that we could be doing to improve our communities, so much better work we could be doing to make people safer and to make our communities more healthy more just and more prosperous. Legend has been a major proponent of criminal justice reform, which is why he's endorsing George Gascon for Los Angeles District Attorney, someone who calls himself a progressive DA. I'm asking you to join this movement. Gascon, an L.A. native, spent 30 years with the L.A. Police Department. He was also the former district attorney of San Francisco. His goal as L.A.'s district attorney, to decrease violence. He says that starts by incarcerating fewer people. We have been able to show that over-incarceration actually makes us less safe. And L.A. County is the prime example of that. Over-incarceration, incarcerating the homeless, incarcerating the mentally ill, incarcerating youth as, as adults. Gascon is challenging incumbent Jackie Lacey. She's been in office since 2012 and was L.A.'s first African-American D.A. But recently, groups like Black Lives Matter have been protesting at her events. I, I understand. Did, did they give my brother time? They didn't, did they they didn't give my brother time? At this event last year, the crowd turned on her when she talked about police shootings and the deaths of black men. There was also concern over the fact that Lacey never filed criminal charges against Ed Buck, a prominent Democratic donor who was eventually charged by the feds for running a drug den and the deaths of two black men. Despite the criticism, though, Lacey defends her record and has strong support from powerful law enforcement unions and political leaders. And we reached out to the Lacey campaign for comment tonight, but did not hear back. As for Gascon, some say he's too soft on crime. In fact, he helped write Prop 47, which reduced nonviolent crimes to misdemeanors. It also made 10,000 prisoners eligible for parole, and critics basically call that a get out of jail free card. Reporting live for you in Hollywood, I'm Chris Holmstrom, KCAL 9 News. Chris, thank you.